The brilliance of America is the vastness. Yeah. You don't really um, know how acute that feeling is until you're faced yeah. with it. Like in the way that we were, we shot in Nebraska and on this cliff. I mean, it was as far as your eye could see. It was like green and um, and the sunsets were beautiful. And there's so much you can pull from that. And I, I think there's a stillness that happens too inside where you can really listen to the wind. And I believe in nature and forming so much of uh, having, there's so much advice there. And we got that. I think we, I felt that way. Yeah, Did you feel like hugely. that? Hugely. And I like how you even frame the question. It's like these spaces in that part of the country are so open and during the pandemic so uninhabited too certainly socially it was a vacuum life had been sucked out of it that to imagine these two characters within that circumstance again pre-internet pre a source of understanding themselves through the lens of anything but their own curse um something about that felt freeing not to be a masochist but it felt like um and i like how taylor said it the nate those, those scenes where we're in nebraska um, my favorite scenes in, the, in that film, Badlands, um, are in those open spaces. And, uh, <laughs> this is totally unrelated. I was just reading an article about, like, in the American West, Midwest, how huge quantity, huge swaths of land are bought now by American billionaires and how attractive that is to have, you know, uh, you know, huge amounts of land to yourself and and how in Europe there there isn't that divvying there's the opportunity to buy land like that and it's not in the culture for you know there's this maverick mentality to conquer uh, the land the way with global warming now we know how reckless that can be but in the 80s in the classic American mindset really is to put your stamp on things and to be a maverick and I think we see elements of that with my characters trying to put a stamp on the world so such futility and such hopelessness because he's a he's a he's a he's a blemish on the world in his worldview.